The National Park Service and Yellowstone National Park release an insightful video into what it takes to uncover Yellowstone's roads from all that heavy snowpack. We groom our roads all winter long for winter use, which snowmobiles, snow coaches, travel over, pack it. And with the amount of snow we get anywhere from two feet to six to eight to 10 feet, it packs it pretty hard that a normal plow will not go through the snow pack that's there. So over the years, we've evolved to where we'll pull a huge wedge grader through with a couple of bulldozers just to break up the snow pack. After the dozers and the beef plow go through, we'll come in with a large wing truck to move the snow back as far as possible in order for us to gain as many miles or footage, depends on how you look at it, per day. And following the wing truck, we'll bring in uh, blowers to clean up what's left on the floor and uh, what the wing truck could not get out of the, out of the cuts. Maintenance Chief Randy Baum says uh, despite the snowpack, it's Mother Nature that's the biggest role in what they get done each day. Along with the video, the park announced spring road closure dates. Here they are. Mammoth Hot Springs to Norris will close March 6th, which it's already closed. March 8th, Norris to Madison and Norris to Canyon Village will close. Canyon Village to Fishing Bridge closes March 13th and March 15th, all remaining groomed roads will close. The roads will reopen after the maintenance work is done. That is expected around April 15th.